What is happening, guys? Cowboy here, and with the Great Ash Lake of Ugh, finally conquered, we're ready to continue on. Like, for real, I, I almost recorded it. I was like, man, they should have to suffer through this with me. But I didn't, because I'm nice. I'm, I didn't do it. I said, you know what? I'm not going to put my viewers through that. I'm not going to make them watch the terrible drone that is climbing out of this shithole. But anyway, ready to go fight Quilog. Quailag or whatever her fucking name is. But I think I'm gonna beat her ass. I mean, to be honest, like, we're rocking a plus 10 butcher knife. And if that's somehow not enough, I can always swap up and beat her down with the, uh... Ooh, sewer chamber key. Isn't that... Sewer chamber. Sewer chamber. I think that's the one that opens up the, uh... I think that's what opens the depths. If I'm remembering right, the sewer chamber key is what connects the depths to Blight Town. I'm gonna have to. Let me check. Let me check here. Let's see. Hmm. I'm not sure. Either that's either it's the one that connects. Hang on. I have I have two keys. Sewer chamber key in the depths from lower... Okay, so that's what connects this to the depths. Which means that with that, I should be able to, in theory, approach the depths from behind. Right? I mean, that would make sense to me. With that, I should be able to... <clears throat> I mean, I'm, it's going to be a big pain in the dick. Well, actually, it'll probably be easier going in from the back, but... I should be able to, to go up into the depths. I'm just kind of running past these guys. I mean, I don't, I don't recall them being worth an amazing amount of souls or anything, and I'm not seeing any items. Um, you may notice I switched the shield. I do remember this fight is filled with fire and lava, and um, well, considering the Black Knight shield has 95 resistance to fire, basically it's just going to allow me to shit all over quite long. I remember these things are not nice. Oh, that hitbox. Oh, fuck yeah, dude. Just get them all down. Oh, really? All of Blade Town, we get no lag, and approaching this, it's like, LARGY! Game, please stop. Why? Why are you lagging so hard? Jesus. Amazing chest ahead. Alright, let's go beat her ass. You know, if it wasn't for the fact that the bottom half of her is a giant spider, I would probably give her the D. Yo, this is really bad, though. I can't even move. Like, the game's not frozen. It's just lagging that bad. Alright, come here, beautiful. No, no, don't go doing that now. Why would you hit me? I just said I would give you the D. And now you're sitting here smashing me and shit. That's not very nice. Listen. How long have you been down here? God only knows. It's been a long time. You're probably thirsty for some good undead D. And I'm here to deliver.
forgot about that. The big old fuck you. I'm gonna make a lot of uh, the big uh, fire explosion thing. Let me chug on up. Nope. Let me finish chugging on up. Come on. This doesn't hurt me. You're just being annoying right now. Pats its head, it's gonna breathe lava. Oh, how did that whiff? Man, Black Knight Great Shield kinda makes you a little chump. That attack whiffs so much. Oh, here it comes, I think. Nope. There we go. That's the kind of damage I want to see. I'm waiting for the... Yep, here it is. Is this it? Okay, that's not the one I was worried about. There it is. That was the one I was worried about. And thankfully, it's it's like a heat wave, I guess, because my shield just crapped all over it. Gotcha, bitch. I'd like to thank the Black Knight Great Shield for completely carrying me through this victory. Like, for real, it just pooped all over her. It was like, stop, don't don't try and fight back. You're not gonna win this. I'm sitting here on fucking 100 physical and 95 fire. And we're keeping this because 80 magic, and I don't know why I have this on... Keeping this just because it's a fucking tower shield and the stability is insane. Because actually, this isn't too far off. It's 62. 55. 51. I don't know why I have the target shield around. I gotta I gotta go through my inventory and get rid of some of this shit. Anyway, that was easy and refreshing. It's nice to, to be able to just you know bend a boss down and, and spank it and make her call me daddy. That's right, that's the bell. Two bells, bitch. Ah, Seddon's Fortress is opening for me. You know that's going to be fun. Hmm. Well, I'll probably use a Homer Bone to get out of here. But, uh... There's exploring to do. I probably won't use a homer bone. There's not really a, a need for it. Hidden path. Like here? No. Nope. Here. There we go. And you're a covenant dude, aren't you? Oh dear. <laughs> Don't matter. I pray that. I know, you get like chaos pyromancy flames and shit from... Get out of the way, dude! I'm gonna kill your ass! Pretty hot too. 
But your spider is like derping out. I don't think we can make this work. What do we got over here? Read humanity? It would have been cool to actually play Dark Souls back in the day when, like, everyone was, like, you know, duking it out and shit with, like, their respective covenants. That would have been a really cool experience, I think. Actually, while I'm here, let me get rid of some of the other shit. that thing. Um, no reason to have you anymore. This way I can put side. I do got a lot of dragon scales. It just sucks this thing doesn't scale with strength at all. It requires fucking 50 to use and it weighs a shit ton. Don't need the falchion or the yes dock. You were 18 decks. I can't use you. You're 46 strength. You're B scaling? It's not bad. It's not a terrible weapon. How about you? You're D scaling. Why are you so much better than this? 138. 290. Like, that's a huge fucking discrepancy considering this has B scaling. Feels bad, man. Let me, um. I mean, I wonder if I'm two handing if it's any better. Black Knight stays, Grass Crest no, Sanctus no, Target no. Let me see. Really? I can't two hand it? Oh no, because I'm 30. So, I'm only getting up to 40. Oh, well, that's why that's so shitty. Even then, though, like... What the fuck, man? I think this should be better. Well, no point keeping it around for now. Just put it back in the box, I guess. Where is it at? There we go. Get rid of it. I'm gonna keep the dragon's tooth around. Um... From what I've heard, you're actually way better off with just like a large club, but I haven't found a club yet, so. I have humanity. Open the fuck up. I'm probably never gonna join the Chaos Servants. Let me kill this dude. I knew it! I knew it! Job for me. Egg Vermifuge. Are we still friends? Are we good? Are you. Alright, yeah, she doesn't give a shit. You douchebag. And if I remember, those eggs are like. They get rid of eggheads. Yeah. Bitter, sour, most parasitic egg from body. The egg bears have chosen to serve the flame of chaos, and the egg symbolizes selfless choice. Chestnuts are forbidden. Yeah, because I remember, don't the eggs like. If you get an egg stuck on your head, it, like, double all the souls you use, end up getting absorbed by it or some shit. It's this way. Oh, no, wait, isn't this go down into, like, the lava? Yes? Yeah, demon ruin. Try and tackle the demon ruins. Damn it! I need to go back to do to ascend my weapon. I mean, I feel like I'd get through this area pretty easily. Right now, at least, I'm kind of tearing it up.
I don't think these things are really worth killing at all. I mean, they're easy enough, but killing them and all the things is only netting me like 90. Um. Well, fuck it, let's. Maybe we'll find some badass shit down here. I don't remember what the purpose of that is. Is there something you can access at the very edge of it? I remember, like, after I go through there, I can fight Bed of Chaos. Fuck off, little thing. I got time for you and your bullshit. I'm here to fuck up a Capra Demon and get me a greatsword. Maybe I'll kill the bed of chaos while I'm at it. Actually, I probably can't. That's that's probably a Lord Vessel thing. Because it's Nido, bed of chaos, Gwyn. And then I... Well, I think Seath is included. Even though he's not like a Lord, I think he's, he's just included in the bundle because... Hey, it's Seath and he, you know... He dicked over all the dragons, so we're gonna let him be special like us. Safe zone. Oh, is this the centipede battle? I remember there's. I remember there's a demon here. I remember there's a boss. Try rolling. Try fleeing. Safe zone. Yeah. Isn't there like if I go that other way? I don't remember how this fight goes at all. I remember it being really weird. Like. Don't you, like, get him stuck, and then you just start beating him up? It's like a f it's kind of like a face. Like, if you tilt your head to the right, it looks like a face. Like, we're locking on above him. See, those are, like, eyes. And that's, like, a mouth that's right in front of us. What's up, buddy? He's not even interested in us. Can we not? Like, it gives no fucks that we're even here. Now it does. Oh, shit! God. I was like, yeah, let me poke this thing, make it react. Oh, it reacted. It reacted in a, uh, a very loud way involving smashing my shit in. Jesus. I don't even know what to say to that. That thing just, holy fuck. Maybe I was, that's, maybe I was supposed to just walk the fuck past and be like, uh, I'm not here to fuck with you, dude. You do your thing, I'll do my thing, we'll call it a day. Hey, awesome. Glad we could come to an agreement. I mean, what this really comes down to is hitting this thing in the face with an arrow is not a good idea. We really pissed it off. But I remember there's some fucking gimmick. No, I can fight him. Bed of Chaos is the thing I can't fight. Bed of Chaos is the one I need to, like... Lord Vessel for. Well then how do I even fight Ceaseless Discharge? Almost like you like sneak up behind him or something and then you can just like one shot him. Or not one shot him but he's like vulnerable and his head can't turn or there's there's some fucking gimmick I gotta remember for this thing. Almost like you drain the lava out or no that's not it. What are up with all these messages? Try fleeing, try run. Like, why? Do we. Am I. Is that it? Do I gotta just run past him? For now? I mean, same as before, he doesn't even give a shit that I'm here. He's just like, fuck you, dude. I'm going back to taking my nap. I don't remember what the. There's a trick. Oh, well, now he's pissed. 
Because I grabbed that soul of a proud knight. And he's going to throw lava. And try and do stuff. I'm just waiting for him to get close to me and fucking ruin my shit. Like that. That's what I was looking for. Is that this whole fight? Is he just... This is like... Fucking, uh... It's like Discount Iron King. It's like the Iron King, but just slower. And he just leaves his arms sitting out for you to whack for a bunch. I mean, if it hits, yeah, it hurts, but now he has, like, an absurdly long down period, and I can just beat away at him for a little bit. Let me try something. Because this thing has natural fire defense built in, doesn't it? We're gonna... Come on, dude, try and swing. What a joke. Victory achieved. Thanks, Scrub. Oh, that's it. All the lava gets hard or something. Now I can explore. Hooray. Humanity and a homeward bone. What a pushover. I mean, even the item I had available was like a soul. It's weird, because I'm like thinking back to this game when I did the drunk through of it, and I remember the drunk through having so much difficulty and being like scared to fight any of this shit. I was like, oh my god, it's gonna rape me, and I'm just walking through like, boop, you're dead, boop, you're dead, boop, fuck you, boop, out of the way. I mean, right now, it's not like I'm running shit that's too crazy. Like, by this point in the game, you could have the Butcher Knife, and you could have it upgraded to plus 10. So, weapon-wise, it's not like I'm running, you know, anything super crazy fucking powerful. I mean, my tower shield's a little bit OP, I guess. Like, that's the only thing I could think. Uh, maybe that's making a difference, but... Probably not. I did it. Like, considering what a pain in the ass the, uh, Ash Lake was, suddenly I feel like I got here, and I recall the Demon Ruins being, like, the you-bout-to-get-fucked area, and instead, this has been, like, the gravy train, man. I was like, toot toot, who wants to join the gravy train? Come on down to the undead ruins and fuck up every enemy you see. Ceaseless discharge is a basic bitch. Just go on and hit him once and look at that, he's down. Well, not once, but, you know, swings big. It's like a big, I don't know, a big dog that, like, barks a lot, but it's, like, too slow and derpy to bite. So every time it tries to bite, you just slowly, like, walk to the side. And then you're like, no, bad dog. And it tries to bite again. And you're like, no, stop. Dog. Bad dog. Stop. And she's like, wolf. You're like, who left their mentally challenged puppy out to attack people? And that one guy runs up and he's like, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. We've been trying to, to kennel train him and 
it just doesn't work. And I'm like, dude, you gotta not do that. He's too derpy to be wandering around on his own. Man, Demon Ruins is fucking gravy cake right now. Though I really should go do... See, the only thing is right now, if I leave this area and I go do, like, Sen's Fortress and Norlando, then I'll get the Lord Vessel and I can start teleporting places. And that's a fuckload of Taurus demons, like, Jesus. Guys, maybe you want to tone it back with the number of Taurus demons? You don't think that's maybe one or two many? One of those fucking things. Capras. Like, I haven't even been down to Lower Undead Burg yet to fight the actual Capra Demon boss. Stamp, Black Boat, Ferris, Mailbreaker, Painted Guardian, Watch Call, Silver Coin. Yo, bro, I need you to give me your fucking swords, because I love them. Give me a sword. Big money, no whammies. Nothing. Cheap asshole. Oh, 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 oh. Whoa, holy shit, that fucking hurts. That hurts a lot. Sweet Jesus. Where's that fucking ring at? Yeah, put that on. I don't expect that to do much, but god damn. And before I go and, and consider doing uh, Sense Fortress, though, why don't you get hurt rocking through the lava? That's not fair. Oh, and you guys have the Great Axe. Can we fight, like, one at a time, guys? Like, I'm not really interested in fighting two of you simultaneously. If you would form a nice, orderly line, I will take you on as intended. But you need to form that line, alright? You can't... No. 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 There's a strict one demon at a time limit. Don't break that limit. Don't break the limit, douchebag. Sooner or later, one of them is going to de-aggro, and the other one I'm just going to beat down. One Diagro. Now I can. No, nope, he didn't. He's running around to me. Well, whatever. This gives me a clean opportunity to fuck you up while your buddy's not here. Man, he's making me roll all over the place. If you could drop that axe, I heard it's like the best strength weapon in the game, so I'd appreciate that. That's right, come and get me. I wonder how far back I can kite these fuckers. At least it's just the two of them and not like a whole army of them. Listen, I will fight you. Just let your buddy go. I know you guys have this weird jerk off fetish where the only, you can only jerk off if your friend's there to watch you, but that's not what this is about. You have to fight me. Man on beast. I like how I'm blocking, but it's still knocking me the fuck back every time. He's like, you got him, bro? You got him? I'll come help, bro. Don't worry. Ooh, shit. There's gotta be a trick to this. 
because the idea of fight, like, I mean, one-on-one, -on -one, like, yeah, it's, it hits hard, but it's not unstoppable. Like, you know, good positioning, rolling through its attacks, blocking when you can't roll. It's definitely doable, but fighting, like, five of the at once just seems like, what the fuck? Like, how do you do that? I just get some baity jump attacks in? Well, your buddy's dead. Come and get it. Oh, laggy lag. Hey, did you hear about Jeff? They made him a boss. Guess what I did? I plunged, attacked him until he was dead. Yeah, that's right. I'm talking about your old buddy Jeff, the one you used to play cards with on Friday night. No, he's dead. You're gonna be dead next, so you can go play with Jeff down in hell or wherever you go when you already die, because this is kind of already a hell type area. Nope, you missed. Might pull out a bigger weapon. Um, let's see if I can bait like one. Because one by one at a time, these guys are quite easy. Uh, though we are starting to go long on episode length, so I kind of just want to. I want to get those items over there before I wrap up completely. That's my goal right now: is to just get the goodies. Oh, I'm fat rolling. When did that start happening? That's no good. The only thing I've swapped out... Wow, that ring weigh that much? No? Oh, it's because of this. Alright. Next up to the plate. Alright, who else? Come and get it. You're up. Come challenge the mighty chosen undead. Man, that sucks. Two hits and you guys get staggered. Feels bad. Alright. And now you? Fuck that up. I done fucked up. Anyway, we're going to wrap this one up here. I'll kill these dumbasses in the next episode. Um, and then I'll probably make my way down as deep as I can in the demon runes because, you know, why the hell not? So anyway, make sure to stay tuned, and we'll catch you guys next time with more of the randomizer run.